Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you want to know how I got this aesthetic looking blurry background, okay, my background is not that fine, shower, but if you want to blow your background, this is where to be. I just want somebody to talk to. So basically, I'm going to start by, I'm going to turn on the screen real quick because I'm using my phone. So I don't have any other phone to film with and show you guys everything. So I'm just going to do a screen record of how I do everything so you guys can see what I'm talking about, okay, when I'm talking about it. All right, so let the screen record start. First thing I do is that I open up the app. The name of this app is Mavis, as you can see. And I'm going to be using those books as my background, trying to get like... Um, not to arrange background and i'm going to be using my stethoscope as the person who is supposed to be in focus so this is what you get when you open up the app at the top there you can see my iso you can see my shutter speed which is currently locked and you can see what i'm filming in which is 1080p and all that basic information if you want to play with the 1080p like um if you want to film in 4k you need to get the premium version okay and other things like this you need premium version to assess that but you can control your eyes iso you can control your shutter speed without getting the premium version and you can also control the focus which is really amazing the right hand corner the left hand corner i can see all this information where i can control my iso where i can control my shutter speed and all of that and the right hand corner you can see the microphone and also where i can control the focus so right now i'm just controlling the shutter speed and when i'm done i'm going to lock it just because i like filming in manual because i like to be able to control my shutter speed and my iso okay or target sometimes if you are new to the whole photography controlling iso controlling <laughs> shutter speed my dear just feel in target don't film in auto please don't film in auto your light is going to be messed up because especially when you're filming with natural sunlight your light is going to be messed up so just film in manual okay and or target if you don't know how to play with your iso and your shutter speed right now i'm just playing with the focus and also in the focus i either use target or i use manual but most of us most of all i use manual because i can control it because i'll show you in a bit that the closer you get you need to also regulate the focus if you go further you need to regulate the focus and this is the front camera hi with the front facing camera you cannot get a focus like you can't blow out your background with your front facing camera so you have to use the rear your rear facing camera if you want to get that blow background turn on your lights your rear camera lights and control your iso and your shutter speed i can't say this is the best shutter speed to film in or this is the best iso to film in because depending on the weather it just depends on a lot of things um in depends on your filming condition honestly before you can um i can say that oh this is the best iso or this is the best shutter speed so you just have to play with it till you get the best view so right now let us mess with this let's play with this and get the best and get i'll show you the blurry background as you can see the l on my um stethoscope the litman sign on my stethoscope is clear okay the light is too much actually so i'm just going to reduce my iso and also play with the um focus so you guys can see all right now i have played with my iso a bit so it's now clear and i'm going to play with my focus still i have brought this to clear focus whenever i'm using this i use my a mirror as a viewfinder so that i can be able to see what's going on behind me if i'm in focus or not so the closer you get the you have to adjust your focus the further you get you have to adjust your focus like what i'm showing you right now so as you can see i'm adjusting my focus till that l sign comes to focus and my background is blurred but the further you get the lesser the blurriness of your background is there anything like blurriness maybe <laughs> but the closer you get the blurrer 
your background is like what i'm showing you right now so as close as i am you can see that my background is really really blurred out okay so basically all you have to do is play with your iso play with your shutter speed and play with the focus always use manual and don't forget to lock your shutter speed guys basically this app works like a camera you can play with the iso iso you can play with the um shutter speed which is really amazing and really wonderful and also i think that this app kind of it takes out the background noise I don't know just a little because i've tried this i've tried this app a lot like not a lot like i tried my hands on it when i saw it and got it so i tried i just played the app for a bit and every time i make a video there's always like background noise in my house but um it just kind of disappears not really disappears it just reduces it and that's really amazing actually okay and it tries to pick just my voice i use my mirror as my viewfinder because I don't have it yeah. and I'm using my phone so that's why I use up my viewfinder and just try to control the app before I start filming I usually use it for a sit down video I don't really use it for vlogs because what is the purpose of blurring your background in vlogs? I'm talking too much at this point of the video so this is the end of the video guys if there are any other thing you want to see for me medical related tech related youtube related just tell me in the comment section and i'll do for you don't forget to subscribe to my channel this video thumbs up and i'll see you guys in my next one bye